if you're on social media and you're scrolling and you don't even know why you're scrolling, like you don't even know what you're looking for, your dopamine system has been tapped out and you need to take a break from it. I think social media is great and there's a lot of opportunity to learn and see things. Some are funny, some are interesting, some are disturbing. When you're at the point where you're engaging in something and you don't even know what the win is, but you find yourself reflexively engaging in it, your dopamine system is now plummeting. And that's a serious issue. A picture is worth a thousand words and a movie is worth a thousand pictures. So you're seeing movie after movie after movie after movie. What's happening is the context is switching constantly. Our, the human brain has never been confronted with context switching at this rate. You can scroll through a thousand different or a hundred different contexts within five minutes. And that's a big override for the brain. And then the rest of the world seems kind of boring. You know, you see people at dinner scrolling their phone. It's because actually the brain wants novelty. It's seeking novelty all the time. These days I'm, I'm turning off my phone in the evenings. I'm on there a little bit, but I'm finding I'm kind of sick of the phone. I think a lot of people are kind of hitting this point where they're like, I'll get on social media for an hour or two a day, but this is getting a little pointless. Yeah, but you're right. It, it has its place, but it's nice to be able to connect how you're engaging with it, using it, and your feelings with science because then all of yeah. a sudden it's you're in control 